All right. So as many of y'all are aware, you know, HI Media TV, uh, you know, streams on YouTube and Twitch and maybe sometimes some other platforms and stuff. Um, I was looking at my web app while I was uh, um, uh, hanging, like just checking things out uh, while I was playing Yu-Gi-Oh! Oh! Master Duel. And uh, I noticed, hey, that's odd. Why is uh, why is that all available? And then I saw that my Twitch was reconnecting, and that's fucking weird. So I went over to my Twitch dashboard, and I was like, "Your account is currently fucking suspended." To view more, what the indefinite suspension? Botted or automated account? I mean, you guys are oh, acutely aware that uh. Uh, I'm, um, you know, just a normal streamer. And I want to go over why uh, this happened real quick. Um, on Twitch and on Kick, like with Jolie Hales up here, we have, you know, people will come in to chat and solicit for services, as you can kind of see from the chat up here. And so what I normally do is I chastise them because no soliciting in my chat. Then I pull up the uh, J the, the, the Jason list for the Hall of Shame. I'll copy their name in there, throw in a date band, you know, 5, 17, 24, and reason for ban, solicitor. You know, typical stuff. Added, da da da, to list. Right, commit, sync, done. Easy peasy. And uh, what then happens is, is that, you know, we, you know, go up to the app directory up here, and then we scroll on down to the Hall of Shame, and voila, you know, they're added to the Hall of Shame here. You know, this is what we do here at High Media TV to solicitors, bots, scammers, and, and, you know, general people who are awful. We throw them in the Hall of Shame. JSON is available publicly for any other streamers if interested. Now, that's all well and good, right? That, like, that's perfectly fine. Um, the problem is, is that this particular individual, the name of Ryan underscore TTVO, uh, did not look or read the... No, in, in unlike on Kick on Twitch, we have um, the uh, what's it fucking called? Uh, the, 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 the first time chatter rules. I have two first time chatter rules that pe I expect people to follow. One, no solicitation with a parentheses and the exclamation point soul command, which is you know, we'll have our expanded like no solicitation policy. And the second line is don't be a dick. Yeah, that's broad and up to interpretation, but broadly, I let a lot of things slide here. I let people being crass, foul, whatever, but just don't sexually harass me or others, and don't be a racist piece of crap, or a bigoted piece of crap. Like, that's all I ask. Everything else is fair game. So, you know, generally, I'm fairly light laid back in all that. But here's the problem. Uh, Mr. Ryan underscore TTVO really upset that I called him out because what do I do? I castigate? I, 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 I castigate? Add to the Hall of Fame, Shame, ban. In that order. Every single time. And unfortunately, Ryan here did not like being, you know, called out for his wrong behavior. He started sexually harassing me in my chat saying what well, I because you know I told I because he could like after I told him at, like after he was told me fuck you and all this shit I'm like dude you broke the rules be mad if you want suck my dick I don't give a shit you know like gen like general and he and he you know starts harassing me and stuff and then I block him I don't because I, I don't want to deal with him any further so I as a courtesy send his entry to him via Twitch's DM direct message system to the Hall of Shame keep it pushing yeah, a little, little, little petty on my part, but whatever. You know, that was the last I was going to hear about. Hour goes past, and I realize I got nailed. 
I got nailed by Twitch. And it, it, because he reported me. Now, here's the thing. I'm not mad. Like, at, like, Ryan underscore TTVO for being a piss baby. Like, this is piss baby behavior, yes. But I'm more upset at Twitch. Like, at, like, I'm, I'm more upset at Twitch dot, like, Twitch dot TV. Simply for the fact of, I have streamed on this platform for at least three years at this point. I started streaming on this platform, I, like, back in 2020. I started streaming regularly in 2021. It's 2024 now, and I got banned indefinitely, w waiting on appeal, by the way, where I laid all this stuff out. And it took one person to make that call for me to get banned. Now, I'm not, don't, I don't make a, a living off of Twitch. I make some money off of Twitch. In fact, you know, the $20, $30 I was fitting to get this month from Twitch, you know, is goes to a larger pool to help me and my partner live. You know, so now I got to make up the shortfall. I'm not like an Aiden Ross. I'm not a Kai Steen. I'm not. I'm not any of these like you know just smarmy dickheads who are just awful people like and treat other human beings terribly. You know, I'm just a, a small time guy who a, a a solicitor reported me to Twitch, and I got a, and I got banned. I had a, I had 325 followers. I had. 40, 50 hours a month streaming, and I got banned. And it's so unbelievably anger-inducing, like, that I I, I want to scream. It's unfair, and I've appealed, and now I just have to wait for some poor fucking schmuck, like, in, in a third-world country, being paid pennies on the dollar because, because Amazon is, are the devil... And um, and wait for them to you know ap appeal appeal my process. Dude, I I just don't know, man. It's just I'm I'm over it. I, I don't know. I just I still have access to crowd control. You know, I still can use Ko-Fi. I, can, I, I the, I'm. The thing that just frustrates me at this point, if I'm being perfectly honest, is now I have to rebuild the infrastructure for Watchbox and have it not be through Twitch. I'm praying that I can do it with Kick and then eventually get it running with YouTube, hopefully. But, ugh. If y'all want to, like, help me with this and just kind of, like, help me get out of, like, the slightly bad spot I'm in, please consider, like, you know, a dollar a month. A dollar a month, you know, is a boon to my mental health. It helps keep the lights on and it supports what I do. And you get perks on Discord and shit, so. <sighs> I hate it. I hate this place. I hate it. Here, bro. Uh, 